Hello, my name is Andrew Jansen. Today I'm going to talk about some of the insects, some of the deficiencies I'm seeing in the cornfields. But first I want to talk to you about something called green snap. Green snap is caused whenever you have a heavy downpour of rain, a lot of moisture in the ground, and so you have nice hot temperatures, cause that corn really grow. What's happening is the corn is growing faster than what the stalk can handle. And usually it's not either above the ear or below the ear. Or where, the, or, or where the ear will be placed. If it snaps below the ear, usually that plant's done for. It'll start. It'll try to grow back, but it won't grow back a very good ear. If it snaps above where the ear will be, usually it'll grow back, and you can still produce a decent sized ear. Some of the deficiencies I'm seeing, especially, is going to be nitrogen. Nitrogen deficiencies is causing you have a heavy downpour of rain, and it's taking the nitrogen away from it. Or if you have not, or if you have water standing in places, usually the best way to treat nitrogen deficiencies is either side dress or get water droplets. Depending on the size of your corn, that's going to determine what you're going to do. Another cause or factor of a lack of nitrogen is if you have a higher percent of phosphorus or zinc or some other micro and macro nutrient. So different bugs I've been seeing out there. Omi bill bug, stink bug, and army worm. A good way to tell if you have stink bug damage, if you see straight lines of holes, you see what's happening is they have a nostril kind of like a mosquito, and when that corn's still rolled up, it's sticking it, it's sticking it through the corn crop, causing that hole like effect. If you're looking at your corn crop, you're seeing a lot of looks like poop on the leaves. What it's called is called frass. Frass is what armyworm leaves whenever it gets done feeding. So if you're seeing a lot of frass on the leaves, on the ground, around the plant, that's a good indicator that it's a armyworm feeding. Soon we're going to be looking at some of the roots developing, a lot of the nodal roots. That's a good way to check how healthy your plant is. is dig up your root, see how big those nodal roots are and whether they're going into the ground. Or if they're extremely, if they're going outwards, because that's going to feed the plant later on down the line, later on down the road. And also make sure your corn is starting to grow those base roots, so so it can stand well. And when it has heavy winds or heavy rain, it doesn't blow over. Thank you.